Hello, this time we're going to test out the Sardi Monocolora script. We're on a Linux Mint system. We are 7 September. Our Sardi version is 7.6-2. We have uh, all these selected. You can find these in, uh, in GitHub. And I was thinking if you want to have something like uh, the sun color, it will be more appropriate for these orange ones and as well this one dark sun so this would be in my opinion a well balanced desktop theme you have these orange elements here here and as well in the icons you will find them back there that's not the point the point in this movie is now to make an uh, to test it out and to make a complete new sardi monocolora script so these are the mono sardi icons this folder is inheriting from this folder and all it has is just places that's it what does this script do it's going to change the colors of these folders the folders you see here and some other elements you can just double click this and then you get a top a blue a body blue and an icon in white meaning you have this icon here this is the top this is the body and the icon image the center icon is white then but that like let's make a new one so we can have uh, another script added to the next study so how can we how shall we do that um, well the best thing to do is go to scalable places I tend to take always the same, I'm looking for it, the folder favorites. You open it in Inkscape, so be sure to have it, sudo apt get install Inkscape. And then you have one element, second element, third element, top, body and icon. All you need to do, know now is the colors. Okay, let's put this aside there you go and let's put this one here this one is the one you change this is your code these are already filled in with colors so you can just double click it and it works what you best do now when experimenting is making ctrl c ctrl v so you have an orig original you can of course download it again from uh, sourceforge but it's there that's one. Two, copy paste this one. Control C, Control V. This is going to become something. I don't know yet. Something. No? No, I've written it wrong, but whatever. Huh? Something. You open it, you display it, rather than run it. And let's make it a little bit smaller. Here we have to decide what the colors will be. The color is now this. This is the old color, do not touch, do not touch. And we have to decide what it will be here. This is the new colors. And I have to delete this line. Voila. Not, should not be there. So bulk of the icons. What is your top color? Ah, well, let's have a look. This is where the fun starts. What color should I take? This one, this one, mm, this one. If you like it, then you have your colors. But let's dig a little, little bit more because I don't like it. <laughs> how about orange? Now orange we have had we had orange already. Um, how about HSL, CMYK, wheel? So that's not so bad actually. And then maybe in the white area. If you're into green, of course, that's always a discussion. Is green a, a nice color or not? Um, is this okay or not? So this could be it. This could be your color. Don't think there will be much demand for this coding. So I keep looking. I keep looking. Maybe first start with the big, the big uh, portion. Yeah, why not this this small? Then again, it's yellow, orangeish. You know. Let's go around. 
see anything you like, and then you stop. There's more the brown, let's put it more in the middle. I always go back to the yellow and the orange icons. That's because of uh, personal preference. Mm -hmm. We have already a script that's making it everything red. So I'm looking really for something new. We don't have purple yet. Why not? And then this, well, something similar. But not the same. Or something else. So let's go around. Oh, this, this goes well with that color as well. And you could make the same color here as well. Let's make it come back, but in a lighter version. It's an idea. And this should be maybe a little bit lighter then. How about this? Okay. We have to stop here because, yeah, otherwise the movie will be too long. What's next? You're going to take this one. Control C. Remember that's a top. So you go to the new color top. Control V. Get rid of the double F's. This is the body color. No, this is the body color. Control C. Control V. F F com. This is the color for the icons. Control C. And Control V. A bit lazy, like in all my other movies. Control C. I'm going to take the same here for the document open. Voila. F let's check. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's correct. This color is ending in B3. Yeah. And this color is ending in F. C F. Okay. Fine. Save. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Don't save it yet close without saving. This is the copy, the original is and uh, this original now and this will be uh, changed. If you check out the lines which are at this point in time in the movie not relevant. But now we know what we're going to make. We're going to make the top O. o. Bluish, greenish, purplish. Let's let's stay Top purple, body purple, and the icon, I don't know anymore, so purple. So we're going to change it when it, after it runs, it runs so we know what color it is, more or less. So, double click, count the seconds, done. We have a new theme now, let's go and change it. Here you see already the effect, but the best is just to say change it in the theme manager. So it's more bluish, purple, and the question if you like it or not, that's something entirely different. So that's how you do it. Do you do something more from now on? Well, to be on the safe side, you can change it, in the, it again. And I have always, I, when I have a lack in um, fantasy, I go to GPEG, I press on spacebar now and ask the machine, aha, it's the color plum. So, sorry guys, it's going to be called plum. Yeah, so I go to the Sardi Mono Numix Colora. Ah, sorry, that's another movie. <laughs> Sardi Mono Colora, this one. And I should call it Sardi Monocolora Plum, for instance. So I know it's made out of Monocolora, that's the start, and I edited something, I changed something, and I made now a Sardi Monocolora Plum. So the reference is gone, that's why the icons change, but of course nothing has been changed. Here it is, it's called now Plum, and I can select it as such. So, of course, I've got my Sadi Monocolori original is now gone, but if you didn't like it, whatever, and otherwise download and copy paste again. Should we do something more? Yes, this is not necessary anymore. That's original. Icon theme cache, delete just to be sure. 
and index team as you can see it finds everything but nicer would be if you add plum inside it because when you change from this rows then maybe it will read this rather than a folder okay nothing to be changed here so in fact we have made ourselves a new icon team the only thing we need now is something uh, similar as background and uh, that's not so bad actually and that's it all right that conclu concludes the movie have fun making a new icons with this Sardi Monocolora. Bye for now.